The Ministry of Culture, Youth and Sport has launched its National Archives database project where it is envisaged that all records in paper or other forms will be digitized for quick and easy access as well as for proper record keeping. The technical work to get the project up and running was demonstrated by Robin Singh who is the CEO of Dev Infotech. And really the goal is to uh, enable historians and uh, individuals uh, to do online searches uh, uh, of immigration records uh, of their ancestors' personal landing and place of origin and documents based on the digitized database that we will create from the records and registers here at the archive. Minister of Culture, Youth and Sport Dr. Frank Anthony said that such a project has been long in the making and that he is finally glad to see its fruition. He said that his ministry took a decision to launch a project during the indentureship celebrations. We have, I think, most of those disembarkation records here in the archives. And this project is going to help us to digitalize that, put it in a searchable database, and make it available. Our quest is really all the records that we can find uh, to eventually make it digitally available. And uh, I've spoken to the Chinese ambassador uh, and we are also looking to see whether or not we cannot retrieve some of those Chinese records. And we are talk talking to other institutions to see whether or not we can retrieve some of the records that we do not have. The launch was attended by members of civil society, the business sector and school children. Reporting for Capital News, Royal Collins.